Yeah. Often, uh, and let's look at your experience, yeah. right? So you said you were 13 and you knew you were in love yes. with this. Did school help you develop that, nurture that mm. love? In a very small way. I mean, it is, I think, film is a part of the curriculum mm. in a very, very small way, but like an introduction to film. Um, I wouldn't say that's what introduced me to it, but it encouraged me to see that it was um, part of, you know, there were other people out there who also were in love with film, also wanted to do it, and, you know, there were, yeah, the, it, it's encouraging to see there are more people through a system like that that you can get to meet and you can get to um, collaborate with, I guess. Liana, yeah. do you think, uh, you know, in terms of youngsters who are at high school at the moment, they may have a love for movies. Is there a space for them to develop that love at the age of 13, 14, or 15? You know, it's really interesting because I went to a very little Indian school that didn't have drama even. And um, to be honest, I think that it, it made me more passionate because here I had to be my own director, my own filmmaker. I had to find my own projects to work on, write my own little plays, cast them. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, I think it just made my love so much stronger because I just wanted to fight the system of accounting and mathematics <laughs> and I just wanted to get there and do my own stuff. English helped. English was amazing um, with Shakespeare and stuff. And I think we were introduced to theatre and um, th that's where the love affair really just blossomed, I guess. So if it's not happening at high school level, uh, you are largely dependent on your family and friends to be a supporting crew. Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, and, and, your, and your pets, and your pets. Right. <laughs> so uh, was it a difficult task, uh, Nathan? I'll come to you first, to convince family and friends to believe in um, this is what you want to do? No, not really, actually. I mean, every friend wants to be in a movie at the age of 13. <laughs> <laughs> you can go. <laughs> so what was, your <laughs> what was your first one called? Uh, Liana uh, was 55, Mango Drive. Geez, mine was Magic Chip. <laughs> Magic Chip. Yeah. Right. That's that's an interesting one about a guy who could make himself disappear by putting a digital chip between his hands. That's, that's quite a. That's interesting. Yeah. So so he'd stick a a, a, a microchip between yeah. his he'd, hands. He'd clap between clap it in between his hands. He'd put it in between his hands and clap his hands, and he'd disappear. So how did you do that? <laughs> that did was, you make it? Yeah, yeah. That was uh, like a special effect that effect that I figured out when I first picked up the, up the camera from watching Lord of the Rings. <laughs> so you what, you're a teenager at the time? Yeah, um, I was 12 at the time, yeah. Wow, magic chip. 